Welcome, I'm Daily Fix, and we are playing Stellaris at United Nations of Earth. Now, before I get started, I changed my microphone settings. I hope that this is, is better and more clear. If, if, if you think I messed it up completely, let me know. If you are someone that is specialized in audio setups, hey, contact me, because I could definitely, definitely use a hand with that stuff. So, we're currently colonizing, and we are trying to rush towards this system over here i would really like to have it i don't like the fact that kotor is already taken because i feel already that i'm going to be boxed in really soon and this is definitely a place where i would like to have a, a station maybe a backup station over here might even be more important than getting a station up in this sector uh, what are you doing oh there's something over here um, I think... Oh, there's primitives. Early space age as well. Okay, that's cool. So, control, shift, research this project. Because it is almost in alien territory. I would really like to research that. I think we can actually go into their sectors. Which is really nice. Uh, I also changed the thumbnail. A few episodes back, I think. Hope you like it. Um, you are also going to be researching into this direction and I would really like to get this planet as well um, the biological pop happiness plus five is, is amazing and the physics research plus 10 but the energy from energy credits from jobs plus 25% that is that is gorgeous it has a lot of districts as well so if we could get all the way there it would be fantastic so let us um, stop uh, not stop let us unpause and continue uh, what we were doing with our planets also i know that version 2.4 uh, 2 has been released i'm not playing on it yet uh, i'm worried that some of the mods might not work and i'm going to give it at least well till the end of this week until i update and then we'll go in there. So I would like to get automation on. We know that that is not working. Consumer goods is something we need to focus on as well as the unity. I think the unity is it, it, is a bit too low. We'll get that early on. Oh, minerals from this. This is going to be such a mineral mine. That is going to be amazing. I love it already. Um, three pops. We need five. One pop. One pop. Leader experience gain, that is not the best. Also, um, I got um, my friend, Philip Hall. He would like to be the uh, the first general of the armies of the Earth. Now, I, I don't have a general yet on army upkeep, negative 20. Uh, but once we do, uh, Philip Hall is going to be the very first general. Now, that all said, if you want to be one of the uh, the leaders... Or have a ship named after you, a fleet or a planet, I don't care. Let me know in the comment section. Use it. And also, thank you all so much for every one of you that has been bumping the videos with likes and subscribing and leaving me comments. I, I truly enjoy that. I truly do. Let us see if we can actually get a new ruler. Um, I kind of like to get the research. Let's get the cheap. No, well, not the cheapest, but the youngest. And we're going to be firing the, the other fella. And uh, we've been paused, so it doesn't really care, matter how we do it. But um, 74, 47. Yeah, I don't think it changes all that much. Maybe it changes at the first, but we'll have to see about it. Uh, research wise, mm, Empire base. Well, it's it's all fine, I guess. Oh, there was a change. You did see it right there. So we went up by one, which is nice. We got the research speed plus five. Colony development speed is, is not too interesting. Capacity overload. Energy grid. Now, the, the energy grid is nice. Truly is. But the capacity overload, by the time that we'll use it, we'll, uh, well, we have some problems. I think this as a flat bonus to 20% credits from our technical jobs is um it is going to be so much better because we produce 116.91 so plus 20 percent there and that is not true what i say what uh, i should say it is by the planets 
it will be increased because there are your technicians. So that will definitely be very, very nice. Point defense weapons firing rate. Ooh, that is some. If you have a carrier, this is going to be a nightmare. Really nice tech. I love it. Plasma throwers, which. Extra armor damage and hull. It is quite nice. It is quite nice. But since we already have someone next to us that is quite friendly, we might not have to go in there. They're overwhelming. They're protective. That will change eventually. I will not allow myself to become a vassal state or a protected. I need to boost up my alloy production quite a bit. So I'm hoping this all will go quite smoothly. Um, let's see. After... Spending an extended time studying the remarkable features of the planet below our science team on board the US, uh, UNS Tesla uh, are ready to report their findings. And there is something interesting going on. We got some unity, which is great. I love that. Um, let's see, can we boost up the... I think we can. What we need to be doing is, uh, is getting about a thousand, a thousand food. And we can go into decisions and just... Boost it up by 25, which is gorgeous. Do we have edicts already for uh, growth? Monthly food. Immigration. Wait, um, no, that's population growth out of immigration. Hmm. Wait, what? This isn't on. I didn't know you should. Uh, you had to activate this. This is a country event. Let us turn it on. And here you can choose between various, uh oh, crisis options. Um, wow, not aware. It is turned on at the moment, so that that is quite nice. Uh, for spawn menu. Select from anomalies. I don't want that. I think everything is on. Broken clock options. Disable the event. No, no. We don't want to disable the event. So it is on. We don't have to do anything about it. Oh, that's quite nice. So let us continue. So we got two colony ships. And one is already colonizing over here. So there we go. We got another planet. And the other one is currently on the route. You are building up stations. And you are heading over there like there's no tomorrow. Hmm. I, I wonder what is going to be over here. I, I'm thinking it's going to be horrible. That is my my idea. You are researching these um, these anomalies that are so strong. I'd like to get an exotic gas as well. That would be quite nice. Uh, the station is building ships, corvettes, they're pushing it out, I like it, keep pushing them out, let us um, upgrade our ships as well, and I guess we need to make sure that we increase the fleet even more, so, um, off transmissions passed, as expected, the, um, the ship has located the source of the transmission, um, emanating, emanating, emanating from Derrick Free. While the planet is otherwise seemingly untouched by alien hands, a lone monolith of uh, of some slick of white mineral stands atop uh, a hill. Mm, signs of her has gone out of the way to establish perimeters with the special project. And I think we need to do it. Let's approve this initiative. Whoa! Hallucigen removal? That is very expensive. So where is this at? Over here. So let's control alt survey project. So that is going to be done uh, first off. We'll, we'll be hoarding influence to the best of our abilities. Um, Federated. Join a federation will please these guys. I'm not sure if I'm, uh, I like that. I'm not the biggest fan. Uh oh. Oh, that that that's going to be bad. Well, we're still building up, which is very nice. This will increase, and they're no longer protective. That is what I wanted. I don't need these guys to be feeling sorry for us. 
We are not interested in that. All we want is making sure that we will live. So they're now superior and I want to push out some more if we can. Um, plus eight. Becoming the drilling? Begins the drifting battlefield event chain. Plus, where, where is this located? It is in Derp 3, which is over here. Um, the memorial message described the loss of hundreds of lives in a battle millennia past. Hmm. Apparently this described the hawks were left in place as floating grave markers. We're going to be, uh, we're going to do it. Has been uh, I, I'm really, I'm way too curious not to do anything with it. That could go. Fleet upgrade can go. Maybe it's over here. It's quite weird that we don't have any follow-up. Maybe it will have to come. I, I don't know. It, this, it is in this. It is in, in Derup. So, quite surprised that is no event following it up. Maybe in the future it will pop up and I'll, I'll be feeling sorry for myself because I, I really messed up then. So they're going to be building over here. He doesn't have to go there because we already seen what's in it. So survey this still. And then I would like you to go into this direction. And let's see what is over here. Because it feels like there is a, a there are not many connections to our uh, west. I'm quite surprised about that. Usually it is, there's a lot of connections. This could save me, it could also kill me very much though. What can we do over here? Not as much. We don't need all of these just yet. Although the production is quite nice. The Beacon of Liberty and the Psionic Theories. System modifiers. Trade vi uh, value plus 5. Colony it is quite nice. It really is. But it is darn expensive. That I don't like. So the last one is now colonizing as well. Hey. Wait a minute. System survey concluded. Oh, like that. Uh, I This icon disappeared. Wasn't it? It was gone for a second. Oh, I was just zoomed out too much. <laughs> oh, okay, that's fine. That is fine. You are going over there. We are going to go for this archaeological site, of course. Anomalous readings registered. Oh, in Derrup again. So, impressive structures. Uh, let us... It's weird, didn't we already have this? Hmm. A special project has concluded. Evasion plus five or regenerative whole tissue. Let's retrieve some samples and get that going. So the monoliths are over here right now and we are researching it. It's easy, so that is quite nice. Where is that? All the way down here? Damn! That is a long ass way away from us. Maybe in the future, once we um, we take control over a lot of, a larger portion of the territory of the space, it, it could be something we'd like to do. Um, let us wait up. Let's speed up. Let's speed up a tiny bit. So we're getting some research. And we're still building up that. That is quite nice. You are going to be claiming. You are busy. We are being hailed. We're being hailed again by the defensive pack. Sure, why not? Who did you meet and are you going? Oh, they rivaled them. Uh, we could offer you a migration treaty. I'm, I'm not sure. So let's build it up. Let's. Uh, if they come with it, we'll decide about it. Because it could. It could be that my population will grow at a slower pace. Uh, it could also... Wow. System survey concluded. Um, from immigration is free. Negative free. So uh, we're definitely growing here towards others. There, there's 1.5 over here. 1.4. Uh, eventually it will tick up like all of the planets and they will help out your, your weaker planets. 
No population is growing. This is this strikes me as odd. There we go. It's about time. This will probably destroy. That it was 1.5. Now it's 1 and 0 0.9. So maybe we'll we'll definitely have to save up on food. Uh, developed a new skill. Home in the sky, starbase module cost and starbase upgrading. That is quite nice. Hey, you are a great president. I like you. Anomalous readings. So let's research here. Nothing changed over here. Habitability is a bit down, but we research don't confirmed. actually care about that. A monthly unity plus two. And it locks the additional edicts campaigns. Let's pause here. There's definitely a few more. Education campaign, recycling, healthcare, population growth. We want this. We desperately would like this because it will grow our population and definitely interested in that. Um, consumer goods, negative 10. That would be ideal, but we, we don't need it right now. So energy siphons, energy, oh, the research, leader lifespan. It doesn't sound like a lot, but if you have leaders that live longer, their level is going to be higher. And the higher the level, the more percentage they will get, which is very, very nice. Leader cost, negative 20. Food farms. Hmm. Don't think we need this now. Habitability plus 5. Regenerative halt issue. Hmm, it is nice. It, 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 it doesn't do as much for us right now. But habitability also is in with happiness. We'll go for the research though. Uh, we can actually use the 20% on that. I want to boost out um, research as much, as much as possible. Quite surprisingly, this isn't going the way... I hoped it would be going. Um, what to do with this planet? There's a lot of houses. We don't need to go with minerals, right? So perhaps we should go... With a tiny bit of food. This is definitely minerals. Look at that. Minerals from jobs, 15. And we can make food over here as well as over here. And I would, I would like the food. I would really like the food. Um, this one has no sector. And you want to... Well, actually, it is on colony. Population growth speed plus 20. That's really nice. Refinery world technical. Oh, I've missed all of these options so badly. Definitely want to go with that. Colony as well. Just, just keep boosting them. This is not as bad. Uh, we are going to be boosting up minerals. And we're going to be doing... Oh, this science is gorgeous. Food... And alloys. Oh, this is going to be a refinery world, I guess. We might as well. It's 24 tiles. It's really large. We could eventually change it into a, um, a city planet, which I cannot pronounce the name of. But let's go with food. We want to go up to a thousand. Um, edicts. Can we go with the healthcare campaign almost? Well, not as fast, though. Let's pause it for a second. Mm. Additional pop is really nice. Let's do it. We're already building this one. And wow, a thousand minerals. Whew. Yeah, we want that. Definitely. Energy from technicians has increased now. Leader experience gain. Fusion reactors. Survey. Mm. As long as it's only free, I can still manage. Research station output. We don't have too many of them. Reactors. Do we need reactors already? Don't think so. Plus nine. Is, it isn't much. Hmm. Didn't I add one of these? Like evasion? Wow, um, 
Captain's Ready Room, Evasion plus 10. Uh, yes, please. Ooh, damn! Okay. So, um, we need power. <laughs> uh, definitely power. Uh, there we go. Yeah, that makes my decision a lot easier. Agricultural, uh, mining, and we want to get consumer goods going, although we, we, we will survive. Uh, it's not needed as fast. Wow, that is quite nice. Unfortunately, it's probably somewhere where we can't take it. No, actually, it's over here. Woo! Um, yes, please. Uh, build research stations. And for you, let's build the research stations. We'll have to sell something after getting the edict healthcare. Just a tiny bit more. We'll, uh, we'll take on the anomaly. There we go. Healthcare campaign. Let's do it. Growth speed plus 10%. Which is going to be in here. Genome mapping. Healthcare campaign. And we're up to an astonishing 0 0.22. Uh, it's 1.3 again on these planets. So uh, we'll have to wait a tiny bit. We got a good amount of planets already. And, and, and growth is amazing. We have to go for this planet really feel we have to go for it so you're going over there building uh, you are building as well the anomaly uh, this might be drones but we'll see oh it's 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 that time again it is that time again so let's remove you we have a new archaeological dig site which is right in here Ooh, interesting in search for time well, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I, I'm hoping you are enjoying yourself. If you do, smash that like button and comment me whatever you think about my audio as well as uh, um, leader names, ship names, fleet names, planet names, you name it. The name for the first general is going to fill a hole. And um, yeah, we'll see. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.